What did Unitas mean to me and what training did we accomplish? Two thoughts come to mind. Stronger together and united in purpose. UNITAS is a multinational exercise bringing together countries from all over South America, North America, Europe, and Africa in order to increase our proficiency in conducting security and humanitarian missions. So the first event that we did was uh, the Marine of Steel event hosted by the Brazilians. It was really a sporting event. Who was the strongest platoon? Who is the strongest nation in a variety of events? The ground combat element of Special MAGTAP UNITAS conducted various training events. Starting at Isla de Gobernador, where they did a mount, repelling. The training at Marambaya consisted of live fire squad attacks, jungle patrolling lanes, while the ground combat element was training at three different locations, the air combat element was training at two. To this point in uh, UNITAS, the Red Dogs have conducted parachute operations with both the Brazilians and some of our other partner forces. We've also uh, conducted the uh, forward arming and refueling points. So we've refueled other nations' aircraft and let other nations' uh, refuelers uh, refuel our aircraft. We've also conducted for the first time a close air support with U.S. aircraft um, being controlled by the Brazilian controllers. So Anglico essentially what we do is we attach to other nations and we provide uh, fire support and fire coordination for them. And we have been integrating uh, fires with the uh, Brazilian JTACs uh, for the first time in Anglico history. Uh, we've had Brazilian JTACs control American aircraft and uh, vice versa. The Brazilian JTACs were highly motivated. Uh, they were very successful. We've learned a lot from them and vice versa. Minor language barrier, but uh, at the end, uh, I learned some Portuguese and they learned some English. All of the training that we conducted here in Rio culminated in a final event. And this final event was an amphibious raid in support of a non-combatant evacuation operation in the town of Itioca in the north of Brazil. During the amphibious operation, the multinational force was able to put ashore Marines from nine different nations using both air and surface connectors in order to reach its objectives. The simple fact of being able to get together 19 countries, not only from, uh, from the Americas, we have people here from France, we have people here from Korea, and so that, that's very, very, very good. It's been a fantastic experience for all of our Marines. We, we, we're learning from our partner nations, right? Just like they're learning from us. And so yeah, some of these experiences you, you, can, you can only learn or you can only um, gain by being together. And also to understand um, what they want to learn and, and how we can be better as a team in the future. My observation from uh, day one since we got here to Brazil as a unit it's been amazing. I think all the, I mean, they're trying to learn their culture, their food, you know, they even uh, try to learn their, our language and their language. So a lot of the Marines are trying to learn Portuguese, which is pretty impressive. It's my distinct honor to be part of a multinational force in support of UNITAS 63. We look forward to working with our partner nations for years to come. <laughs>